Where are all my the expanse lovers in the house? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I go by Winnie. This is your first time here. Welcome. But guys, this is season five of the expanse, especially the last episode. Oh my god. But before we get into it, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. Get me to six. 100 subscribers i'm so close uh, thanks if you have subscribed but if you haven't please subscribe this season was so good i'm really sad like honestly i actually teared up maybe i cried i'm like, let me not expose myself here but i teared up when alex died because i did not understand it i know i never really talked about alex much because i just thought genuinely his character was just good like he was just a good person like that supportive person the one that like does every and anything for his crew members like he was loyal like even though he wasn't a good father in the sense of and a good husband to his ex-wife and you know his son being that he was following his own dreams but i'm still happy that he got to do what he got to do you know and he got his own family his crew was his family basically and genuinely he was a good person that i i'm even tearing up as i'm talking because it really got to me i'm like wait how would this guy die like this it did not make sense it did not make sense and it's sad because he died you know saving naomi and naomi like had this guilt that oh my god like it's because of me because of my stupid decisions that he died i mean why is a stroke you know the heart burn is a lot like and that's why he died and I'm just like oh my god why like still i don't understand why they will kill him uh, he didn't deserve to die but i guess like to give that effect that strong effect on the show like someone a main character who is not the protagonist will have to die at some point so ah but if he was if it was um if it was Amos that died, I don't know. It's pain that one will hurt. That one will hurt. Like it will hurt definitely. But it's not him. Let's talk about Marco Inarus. Naomi's ex. Naomi's ex is out here showing these people that yo, you can't mess with me. I'm the number one terrorist up in here. I don't like the guy, <laughs> but he knows what he's doing. Like the guy has this, you know, when someone can speak, eh, them talking who can put you in the grave. Like them talking can save their own lives, like can save lives. Like he's just that type of person, has that type of mouth that you should be scared of because he will talk his way into anything. Like literally, he had the opportunity to die or they had the opportunity to kill him um ashfall ashfold right is it ashfold and um, drama and the other faction the head of the other faction from the belters but they didn't because of what his speech and drama is now feeling bad because she was literally the one that had the power to be like yeah he dies and that's all that was all she would have just saved everybody the stress but because of her because of that decision that she made to let him leave because she thought Marco had a point and that the other Belta factions will like split up because of that decision she made that choice but because of letting Marco go she her friend Ashford died oh, oh that's another person I actually cried for like i was like oh my god i didn't like this guy in season three but why do i feel so sad especially the way he went out like singing the song that he sings to put himself focused and all like that's how marco killed him floated him i'm like yo okay her friend died um she almost like her decision to almost kill naomi because oh my god we'll talk about naomi in a second but yeah like her decision almost killed naomi like and letting marco leave like see what he did like him and uh, marco and his son philip killed people like a lot of people on earth like you know so loki she's to blame but i don't want to put everything on her because 
you know, is at the same time it's not her fault that he's a killer, but she should have listened to Ashford, Ashford when she, he told her that yo, I know people like that. He has a cause, yes, but that kind of person, the cause like they won't stop. It's killing, like. So yeah, so Naomi, oh my god. First of all, for the fact that her son slapped her, I will slap him back. Oh my god, I will slap him back. I'm like, boy, respect yourself. <laughs> I'm playing, but yo, like, I'm like, this boy should better respect himself. Oh, I understand though, he grew up with the killer. So, his father and his mother, like, who will you listen to? basically and obviously you listen to the one that deceived you and told you that your mom left you meanwhile meanwhile like it wasn't her fault and she almost killed herself when she couldn't find her son but she decided to leave and run away instead so i understand naomi's situation but her son slapped her i'm like yo i will sla i will sla yeah when naomi managed to escape you know marco inaro's um spaceship She's so smart and she's so strong because I thought she she was literally going to kill herself because I'm like how would she how did she do it she went out without a space suit and she went out with something that she sprayed maybe to hold the air in until she like gets into the um, other spaceship and stuff so I'm like oh my god like that's so smart like and that's so strong because literally yeah playing with fire like but she would do anything to save james because they were going for the rosinante and she wasn't going to have that she wasn't going to have a guy die and you know james loved this girl so even though it's his girlfriend even though you know he could like easily go towards marco like he went towards getting naomi back and obviously you know what happened was that Alex died in the process of trying to save Naomi and you know but Naomi really suffered like I felt for her I'm like oh my god is this where she's going to die and instead Alex died I'm like okay okay who Amos and his new found boo <laughs> Clarissa is that's her name right the girl that the that has the mud in her I'm like whenever she's changing or she's like going into her transformation zone <laughs> or transition or whatever you call it she's so scary and the way she kills people is so scary but thank god she's on the good side now and amos is so sweet oh my god like i'm actually having a crush on amos and it's weird to me i'm like is there something wrong with me that i'm attracted to someone that is like that <laughs> but yeah like amos Amos is like kind of sweet, especially when he told her like, yo, when they're in that house and he was like, yo, I will never let anything happen to you. And he looked at her, he was looking so serious. I'm like, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm totally like being such a huge fan right now. Like I'm crushing so hard and I don't know if I should be wary of my crush. <laughs> but yeah, I really love that. and. The Clarissa girl, she's no more longer like she's atoning for her sins basically, and that opportunity of what happened to Ed, like was the opportunity for her to escape the hell hole she was inside, and now she's on the crew. She's basically, I think she's basically, she might be a replacement for Alex, like because she also knows how to fly a, a spaceship, right? So she might fly the Resonante. You never know and Han Amos I'm like okay so it's like there you go peaches I'm like okay nah she's so funny been a fan girl such a fan girl Chris Jen and the other woman that were fighting for the undersecretary position Chris Jen lost at first I'm like oh my god like even though Chris Jen is someone who is like strong hearted like she she wanted so bad to win by any means even though she was being emotional on purpose and stuff but she wanted to win and for a good reason because she wanted to be in control any other person wouldn't have done the job as they should so but she lost and seeing her in 
that low position and having the under secretary general the other woman like talk to her and like in a very condescending manner i was like better watch it and she now the under secretary general now died and i oops sorry i know i felt bad i like i actually felt bad but she had to go she had to go she died and all of that so chris jen now has her position again and oh my god the scene where all of them were on illus no on luna and chris jen was like talking to everyone that this is what marco is afraid of that scene was so beautiful i don't know like seeing everybody together because i do not like them separated for some reason i love seeing them together especially james holding's crew so seeing all of them together was just so refreshing to me and easily they could have ended the show then but obviously we do not want that i hope there is season six because they can't just end it the way they did to be honest and what happened at the end yes oh yeah i'm i'm also sad that chris jen's husband like died and like i felt so bad that her husband is dead but what if he's not dead though because i really the guy is a nice guy I really wanted her to have her husband by her side, but we'll see. We'll see if he's actually dead in season six or like, or they are bluffing. Anyway, so yeah, the end, like the way this, the last episode of season five ended with the red thing around, like those people going into the ring. I, I, I feel like that is a big warning sign the round ring fiery thing that killed the protomolecule civilization is probably going to it's probably what was you know the thing at the end and it's probably what is going to like what they are going to fight against is in six in season six and i don't even know how they will get out of that situation like the thing can literally wipe out the whole human race but oh well we'll see i'm so excited i'm so happy that i watched the expand i don't know when season six will happen but yeah i caught up guys and let me know what you think about this season so far i loved it loved it loved it thank you guys for watching until this point please make sure you hit the subscribe button down below give me a thumbs up share if you care if there's any other thing you want me to talk about about the expand give my opinion on please let me know in the comment section down below and yeah until you see you next time guys bye